Diagnostic errors in radiology are a major concern. That is why peer reviews are a fundamental part of the radiology workflow. They allow to collect and evaluate data on reading errors and act accordingly. Research has indicated that every day a radiologist commits three to four diagnostic errors. And diagnostic errors contribute to an alarming 10% of patient deaths in the US. For quality assurance, the radiology community therefore advocates peer review, where radiologists evaluate and score their peers' reports. Peer reviews are mandatory for various regulatory instances or accreditation programs. ACFA Healthcare has developed a module that supports peer review in our enterprise imaging platform. Peer review tasks are automatically triggered and the radiologist doesn't have to open a new screen or a new application to complete them. In this way, it becomes part of the radiologist's daily work. Basically, with our module, we can make peer review as convenient as possible. Now, although traditional peer reviews are initiated with the best intentions, there are several drawbacks to them. Generally, 20% of the studies present 80% of the learning opportunity. So by randomly selecting studies for peer review, a lot of learning opportunity is missed. There is also very little feedback to the report author, and the scoring of the reports often leads to blame culture. That is why we developed our module much further so it supports a true peer learning workflow within our enterprise imaging platform and not only peer review. Peer learning does not focus on how many reading errors occur. Instead, it lets radiologists understand how and why an error occurred so they can learn from this. The ECR Red Peer White Paper on peer learning states that learning from mistakes should be the most important outcome and the process should change drastically to enable this. We specifically developed our entire module based upon their recommendations. It features the possibility to trigger peer reviews manually or automatically, and it offers anonymized built-in feedback loops that allow authors to learn from the advice of colleagues. Another key property of our peer learning module is its configurability. Workflows can be easily tuned from very simple to pretty advanced. As an example, let's take Anna. She's a resident radiologist and reports a chest CT. A few weeks later, John, the senior radiologist, starts reading a follow-up chest CT on the same patient and he finds out Anna missed a small lung nodule in her report. So John creates a peer learning case and assigns it to a random radiologist as a learning opportunity, in this case George. Now George writes down his findings and sends it for review to Jeff the peer learning administrator. Jeff reviews George's feedback and thinks it's an interesting case for a peer learning conference. The conference results in a number of follow-up actions. A follow-up task is created for John as Anna's supervisor. He carries out the follow-up actions and closes the case. Anna gets notified that there is a case on one of her reports and can read the comments. The entire peer learning workflow is completely embedded in the radiologist routine workflow. Enterprise imaging is a task-based system and thanks to the seamless integration of the module, all peer learning related tasks also appear in the activities overviews. ICFA Healthcare's peer learning system is designed to improve collaboration and foster a culture of teamwork and feedback. It's learning at its best and that is the ultimate goal.